praise god amen jesus thank you for your mercy and your grace this is prophet okumbo abraham kenneth i came to bless somebody tonight again another beautiful day that we are in the presence of the lord let us pray may you reign forevermore our father and our god our helper our deliverer we thank you for your mercy your grace and your strength over our life uh, thank you for today in jesus name we pray daniel chapter 12 verse 10 the bible says many shall be purified and made white and tried but the wicked shall do wickedly and none of the wicked shall understand but the wise shall understand the holy ghost spoke to me he said can it go and speak to the people concerning submitting to authority what authority have you submitted your life to your ministry your destiny you cannot submit your authority to anybody who is an agent of darkness there was a time when the lord spoke to me concerning milking and fleecing that certain people who say they are men or women of god they sit down in the church they claim to be what they are not then they say they are looking for prophets or prophetesses who will help them push the ministry forward what they eventually do is that they find somebody who has a genuine prophetic gift and they start to milk and to fleece that man or that woman they ask you to tell them what the lord is saying to you the moment you tell them they're going to use it as their own prophecy unknown to you you're dealing with somebody who is an agent of darkness child of god in this short video i want you to take a look at your life i want you to look around you again it has almost happened to me twice where i found myself sitting down with other people on until prayer started to go to god in the spirit then i realized that the people that i'm sitting down with they had nothing to do with jesus they had been monitoring my life for years and i didn't even know it and the lord said kenneth they want to milk and to fleece the word of god out of your mouth it's always a man with a woman sometimes it's two men sometimes two women they are so crafty so devious so crooked that everything that they do it is just to know what God is revealing to you so that they can hijack it and use it for themselves. Don't let any man milk and fleece the grace of God upon your life. Once you realize that a man is not of God, he has no spirit of God, he has no backing of heaven, you have every right to turn away from that man. So I came to pray with a child of God out there. You may have been confused, convinced by anybody who has uh, a crooked spirit, by manipulators, by uh, impostors. May you never fall in the hands of the wicked in the name of Christianity. May the people who are monitoring your life now to fleece and to milk the gift of God upon your life. Hear the word of the Lord and back off. Get thee behind me, Satan day and night now we are praying to god against agents of darkness they are getting worse they are getting wicked they are getting crooked and they are not going to stop their major assignment is against the elect god said kenneth they are invoking the spirits of men if you find yourself in any place you were not supposed to be there your spirit has been invoked. They have summoned you in the spirit. Go into speaking in tongues. Go into praying in tongues. And pass a decree against anything that you did not support in the first place. Abaya Sadana, Bragada, Uska, Degede Begede Luri, Dinkaka, Yagadu, Eka, Escambra, Brigidi Brigidi Lagada. Every wicked occultic man in the land, your time is up. You shall no longer manipulate God's people. For the earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof. So I decree and declare over every child of God. Place your right hand upon your head, child of God, as we pray. My gift and calling from the Lord, though they are without repentance, yet I know I am genuine with God. I know I am real with God. I know I am original with God. For if there be any wicked man who has seen your destiny, who is, as we speak, silently, secretly, snakishly, slimishly, they are creeping underneath the earth to get into your life so they can milk and manipulate you. Holy Ghost, fire! Holy Ghost, fire! 
Holy Ghost, fire in the name of Jesus. None shall cast their young. No weapon formed against your children, your family, your wife, your ministry, your finances shall prosper. Every curse that came upon your life as a result of your association with toxic people. These yokes are broken in the name of Jesus. I release you, child of God. Go and prosper. Go and be fruitful. Go and be released. Your time has come, saith the Spirit of the Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. I hear the Lord saying, Fear not, child of God. Be not afraid of their faces, for they have nothing to do with Jesus. I told them, I say, God is taking over his church, and what he is about to do is strange. God bless you, church. We will talk again. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen, 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 and amen. Thank you, Jesus. Amen.